Have you ever wondered why some people seem to give off an electric current? Why a simple handshake with a friend might feel like tapping into a live wire? Or why a casual brush against a door handle might spark a miniature lightning storm? Well, it's not because these individuals have superpowers, nor are they aliens from another planet. The explanation is much more down to earth and pretty electrifying too. In order to understand this phenomenon, one must first understand the basics of electricity. Electricity is essentially the movement of electrons from one place to another. In some materials, like metals, electrons are free to move around, which is why metals conduct electricity well. In other materials, like rubber or glass, electrons are tightly bound and can't move around, making these materials good insulators. Now let's bring the human body into the equation. Our bodies, believe it or not, are conductive. We're largely made up of water, and water, especially when it's filled with minerals and salts like it is in our bodies, conducts electricity. But how do we generate this electricity? Well, that's where things get interesting. The human body builds up electric charges through a process known as triboelectric charging, which occurs when certain materials become electrically charged after they come into frictional contact with a different material. Like when you rub a balloon against your hair, or when you walk across a carpeted floor in your socks. In these instances, electrons are transferred from one material to another. This transfer creates an imbalance of electrical charge, leading to the familiar shock when you touch something and that excess charge is released. Now, some people seem to experience these shocks more than others. This can be due to a variety of factors. One of the main factors is the dryness of the skin and the environment. Dry skin and dry air are more prone to building up an electric charge. Another factor is the type of clothes one wears. Synthetic materials such as nylon or polyester are more likely to build up a static charge compared to natural fibers like cotton. In summary, people give off an electric current because our bodies can conduct electricity and we generate this electricity through daily activities that cause triboelectric charging. Factors such as dry skin and air and wearing synthetic materials can make some people more electrically charged than others. So the next time you get a static shock, don't be alarmed. You're not turning into a superhero. It's just a sign of the fascinating electrical world that exists within and around us. Remember, we're all a little bit electric. It's just that some of us are a bit more charged up than others. Isn't science shockingly beautiful?